Hello, YouTubers, friends, compatriots. Who look at your social stars, peasants, vassals, gold bugs, paper bugs, Jamie Diamond's friends. I'm a useful idiot, and let's talk about J.P. Morgan today. More, more specifically, where did all of J.P. Morgan's gold go? That is the question of the day. So a little bit of background. J.P. Morgan, in October of 2010, when gold was at then a record high of $1,320 an ounce, uh, where it's currently hovering around again, um, J.P. Morgan reopened their precious metal vault due to soaring demand. Only the fifth official COMEX private gold depository in New York, along with HSBC, Bank of Nova Scotia, Brinks, and MTV. And uh, the J.P. Morgan Chase Vault is the largest private gold vault in the world. And uh, coincidentally, and kind of strangely, is uh, located immediately adjacent to the New York Federal Reserve Gold Vault. How convenient is that? I hope they don't go all MF Global and, and intermingle their gold. But uh, the vault generally had 2.5 million ounces of gold. And in fact, the total amount of registered investment gold has been pretty steady for the last four years. And uh, now, all of a sudden, on uh, April 6th, J.P. Morgan's commercial eligible gold collapsed from just under 2 million ounces to a record low 402,000 ounces, a drop of 20% in one day. And that's, uh, that was incredible enough. But then 20 days later, um, just around the, the time of the gold crash, uh, a 24-hour period of April 24th, April 25th, J.P. Morgan's eligible commercial gold plunged from 402,000 ounces to just 141,000 ounces in 24 hours, a drop of 65%. So we have the J.P. Morgan vault that had 2 million ounces of gold in it at the beginning of April that now has 141,000, um, a mind-boggling, staggering drop in the amount of gold. And um, this is truly incredible. And it leaves a lot of unanswered questions. Why is this entire move concentrated at J.P. Morgan? And um, also, um, why did this happen uh, just days before the historic gold correction? And then uh, where did that gold go? Who pulled all that gold out? So I'm hoping to uh, find some answers to these questions in the, in the next days and weeks. Um, the story has some legs, and well it should. Um, incredible thing. The result, the total COMEX eligible gold has fallen to just 5.8 ounces, half of what it was in 2011. So uh, 5.8 million ounces, half of what it was in 2011. So uh, so that's uh, amazing in itself. In the last two years, 50% uh, of all the gold stole, stored in, in COMEX vaults um, has gone. So uh, I get the, the feeling that people needed to cover their positions, especially with all that paper out there and all these margin calls. So uh, so anyway, uh, a mystery has unfolded and uh, it just smells really funny, uh, particularly when you have a, a bank like J.P. Morgan that's so involved in manipulating uh, precious metal prices, gold and silver. And uh, so now we have J.P. Morgan COMEX gold vault nearly empty. I'm a useful idiot. Don't you be one too.